Hello children, how are you all? I hope you have enjoyed the previous video on living things and non-living things. Continuing with that, today we are going to learn difference between living things and non-living things. You know that we are surrounded by many things. Some are living things and some of them are non-living things. So what is living thing? Things that have life in them are called living things. Let's see some examples of living things. Humans, plants and animals, insect or bird. All these are the examples of living things. Now what is non-living things? Things that do not have life in them are called non-living things. Let's see some examples. A car, a ball, your books and a house etc. All these are the examples of non-living things. Now how can you identify that the thing is living thing or Non-living things. Living things differ from non-living things in many ways. Let's see. The first one is all living thing moves on their own in search of food and shelter. We human beings moves on our legs. Birds fly with the help of their wings and animals move with the help of their legs. Now, plants are also living things, but they do not move from one place to another place. But some parts of plant shows the movement. Like a sunflower turns its face towards sun and a touch me not plant folds its leaves when touched. But non-living things cannot move on their own. Have you seen any chair moving on its own? No. Our books moves? No. Laptop can move on its own? No. So non-living things cannot move on its own. Next one is all living things grow. They grow and changes their shape and size like a puppy grows into a dog. A small plant grows into a big tree. And similarly, a small child grows to become a boy. And he grows and becomes a young man. And a young man grows to become an old man. But non-living things like balls, dolls, and table etc do not grow. Next one is all living things need food and water to live and grow. The food that human beings and animals eat comes from yes plants and other animals but plants make their own food. They take in water and nutrients from the soil. But non-living things do not need food or water. Next is living things can feel. They act according to their feelings. Most of animals and humans feel with the help of their sense organs such as eyes, nose, tongue, ear and skin. A child smile when he plays with his favorite toy and a dog barks on a stranger. But non-living things do not heal anything. Next is living thing breathe to live. Human beings and most animals breathe air through lungs. We take oxygen and give out carbon dioxide. Fish breathe through their gills okay and human beings breathe through 
lungs and they take in oxygen and breathe out carbon dioxide plants also breathe plants also breathe they breathe through stomata which are small holes present on the leaf an earthworm breathe through their skin but non living things do not breathe next one is all living things produce their young ones produce means they give birth to their young ones of a same kind so human beings reproduce by giving birth to their babies and animals reproduce by laying eggs or giving birth to their babies and plants also reproduce through seeds or other parts of plants like their stem or leaves so children now i think you can easily identify the thing is living thing or non living things so thank you for watching this video till then stay safe and be continue with my channel